हेलो गुड आफ्टरनून एवरीवन आई एम अरविंद सिंह और असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ सिविल इंजीनियरिंग एस कॉलेज भोपाल टुडे माय टॉपिक इज मोर्टार ओके व्हाट इज मोर्टार इट इज अ मिक्सर ऑफ बिल्डिंग मटेरियल लाइक सैंड सैंड मीन स्पाइन एग्रीगेट एंड वाटर it is a combination of uh, mixture is called mortar okay if the cement is, uh, is the building material then the mortar is known as cement mortar okay if you used uh, lime lime then it is called lime mortar and uh, used mud plus water is called mud mortar okay uh, this is the cement mortar it is a mixture of cement plus water okay is called uh, cement sand plus water is called cement mortar use of cement mortar it is used for the building construction uh, it is a binding cement as a binding material to bind major the unit like stone bricks cement blocks etc to plaster slabs balls make them impervious to give neat finishing to walls preparing building blocks etc okay next this is the type of work and cement uh, ratio is to sand okay uh, type of work like masonry work uh, ratio uh, ratio used 1 is to 6 to 1 is to 8 For plastering masonry, one is two three two, one is two four. Plastering concrete work, one is two three two. Pointing, one is two two two, one is two three. Okay. Next lime mortar. Okay. Fat lime, hydraulic limes are used for making lime mortar. If fat lime is used, sand mixed in is normally two to three times its volume. if hydraulic lime is used sand mixed is only two times the volume of lime okay this is the images pictures you can see the pictures mortar mixture of lime plus water is called lime mortar okay next mud mortar mud mortar clay lumps are collected and are weighted with water and allowed to mature for one to one or two days okay one or two days it it is kneaded well until it attains required consistency okay if you uh, if used mud plus water is known as mud mortar okay so this is the complete topic of uh, lime mortar next topic is concrete what is concrete concrete it is, is a composite material it or you can say it is a mixture of cement plus sand plus coarse aggregate plus water is called cement is called concrete okay is called concrete these are the ingredients of concrete like binding material like cement lime fine aggregate sand coarse aggregate water and mixture may be or may not be used okay this is the uh, mixture of uh, different types of material is called concrete okay next uh, production of concrete first of all uh, batching first step is batching or measurement of materials then mixing then transporting after that placing after that compacting then finishing in last curing is the process of production of concrete okay this is the machine machine for for manufacturing of concrete complete process this is the uh, used for concrete okay this is uh, this uh, you can say this image is uh, batching weight batching volume batching machine mixing hand mixing okay next q 
curing of concrete. After that, after used concrete work, uh, after that curing, curing is a process for uh, reduce the hydration of uh, cement. During uh, with water, the process of keeping concrete wet to enable it, 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 it to attain full strength is known as curing. The objective of curing is to prevent loss of moisture from concrete due to evaporation or because of any other reasons. Okay, curing should be done for a period of three weeks, but not less than ten days. Okay. So it is called curing. Next topic is water cement ratio. What is the water cement ratio? Water cement ratio depends on the conditions, uh, weather conditions. Okay. It is the ratio of water and cement is the ratio of amount of water to the amount of cement taken for production of concrete. It's called water cement ratio. After that, these are the test of concrete. So many tests of concrete, testing of concrete. These are two types of concrete, pressed concrete and hard concrete. For uh, pressed concrete, uh, used uh, two types of test, uh, mainly three types of test, uh, lump cone test, uh, compaction factor test, and PV consistency test. For hard concrete, these are the two types of test uh, performed in laboratories. Destructive test and non destructive test. Okay. So, uh, this is called uh, the type of test of concrete. After that, workability of concrete. Okay. The workability of concrete. It, it is the amount of work required to place concrete and, and to compact it thoroughly. Okay. You can say, or you can say, it is a ease with ease with which we can deal with concrete okay workability of concrete increases with the addition of water but it reduces the strength that's why it is not a desirable way of increasing the workability okay so uh, this is called workability of concrete uh, next topic i will discuss next video lecture series Thank you very much.